Hey, what's up, my people? How you doing? It's a beautiful spring night here in uh, Pittsburgh. And this video is going to be kind of a recap about uh, and a new status on if you saw some of my videos. One of my most popular videos is about nude yoga. And it's also about uh, naked yoga, rather. And it's also about me ranting because I was really upset about how YouTube was uh, trying to, you know, just because someone don't like your video or you had haters out there for whatever reasons, probably you, enemies that you cut off or whatever, they said that they thought your video was inappropriate or somebody who was a little bit top heavy you know showed was showing cleavage you know which is sometimes is out of their control you know because you can have a full outfit on t-shirt or whatever and still be you know if you're top heavy you know even for guys you know if you showed a little bit of chest or something like that you just got through working out and or, you, or it's hot and you got your thing open somebody can now i make say oh that's inappropriate you know nevertheless and then youtube was just go around and I felt that they were being discriminated too against race. But um, I had a friend of mine, she came out and said, well, you know, there's black women doing naked yoga, yoga too. Well, that may be true, but it's the principle of the matter I'm talking about. As my stepfather said one time, sometimes it's the money doesn't matter. It's the principle of the matter, okay? And the principle of the matter is YouTube have and holding people up to different standards, okay? Show a little cleavage or something like that. Then they uh, demonetize your video or push it to the side and say it's inappropriate. And sometimes they automatically just say it's inappropriate without even seeing it, okay? Nevertheless, they were letting all this nude yoga, women and men, on YouTube, okay? Showing everything, Okay? And some of it, I mean, and when I say nude, I mean completely but nude, okay? So I'm just, you know, I'm I, now they're starting to do something a little bit. People, not just me, a lot of people came, came, came out and complained about it. It's like, look, you're having this double standard. You're always going around telling people that you're fair, that you're a great media company, you're fair. You know, whether it's a small or big uh, uh content creator you, you're fair to all of them well it's bullcrap you know they weren't now they're doing more surveys and they uh they actually deleted some of those new yoga videos that was nothing but porn it really wasn't they weren't really doing no yoga they, it was nothing but porn you could tell like there was some strippers that was pretending to do yoga, but they really wasn't, you know, it was just porn. Well, they kind of deleted those, you know, and they're being put more age restriction, uh, restriction on the new yoga or, or the content warning on the new yoga now. Before, they were just letting it go, and then us... YouTubers that were following the rules, they were hammering down on us. You know, it's kind of like what our IRS does. IRS openly admitted that people were 400, making 400,000, 400,000 dollars or more a year are often not, you know, even the big companies are often not audited. But anybody making like 20, 20 to 40, thousand dollars a year are audited you know and then their excuse the uh, irs excuses uh, well we don't have enough people to handle the complex situation of a richer bullcrap then train them just like you train the other people to audit the people you know and the same thing with youtube you know i'm not getting off track i'm just saying the same thing with youtube no you know, what's good for the goose is good for the gander. You know? And um it really was no it's no excuse for that. And one of my uh associates, you know, friends, 
she was up there saying, um, oh, they have black women. Because I, I stated it was, and it is mainly white women and white men. Okay. Sure, there's, <laughs> there's a cup of chocolate chips in there. It's black people, but it's mainly white women and white men. Okay. And they, uh, <laughs> And she was in, so it ain't being purged. Yes, it is. It's, you know, they, they still can be purged just because they throw a, uh, a bone to the black people and try to act like they're not dumb. You know, one person out, one one black person out of uh, 1,500 white people. And, you know, they just cover, try and cover their butts. But still, the principle of the matter is that they're holding the YouTube creators that's doing everything by the book by a higher standard and those that showing porn on their sites um, then they're not you know they're letting them do it and that's not right the majority of those people are white white men and white women now here's the deal like I said what's good for the goose good for the gander you know and now they're being more they're actually checking out when someone's saying that something is not appropriate, don't look appropriate, actually, uh, want, watching the videos and seeing if it, if if it's a hater saying it or if it's really not appropriate, you know. And some of those people are very serious about yoga. Okay, I I looked at some of them. Some of those people are very serious about yoga. They're serious about new yoga and all that other stuff. Fine, they take it serious. They ain't. They're not trying to, they really are serious yoga people. But then you have the other ones, you know. But eat, whether it's serious or not, the principle of the matter is, they, 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 were, there are, they're still holding up people at different standards. Those who are playing by the rules that YouTube has laid out are getting punished more than those who are breaking every single rule. Okay, and but now YouTube slowly because not just me, a lot of other content creators have gotten upset about it and and have came to YouTube about it. People of all colors, all con content creators of all colors, have come to YouTube now. They're actually doing something. Okay, putting up warnings, uh, making sure the people at least eighteen years or old, older, not not uh demonetizing those who are actually as much as uh who's actually going by the book youtube's rules you know and not just taking someone's word for it who may just be a hater you know uh that your content is improper you know uh some of my content some of my videos were marked as you know you had to be 18 years or old but it dealt with uh george floyd it dealt with his murder in certain situations like that, so I understood. You know, I don't want a little kid have to be uh, subjected to to the harsh harshness of ignorance of our life. You know, let them be kids while they're kids, so I understand that. Okay, let the youth be youth while they're youth. But that is uh, my recap on. Uh, my new yoga uh, rant uh, and what YouTube is doing about it now. They're actually taking it more serious and they actually are finally, you know, they're taking it more serious and and people are voicing their unfairness that YouTube is doing. So they actually are trying to work out their mistakes. Okay, so I give credit what credit's due. All right, so that that's my recap. This is Dalton, and this is my YouTube channel, Dalton My World. I ask you to subscribe, comment, give me a thumbs up, share this video. All right, and I'll wrap to y'all later. Peace.